There are many reasons, maybe due to those kind of reasons you are trying to recover your Microsoft PowerPoint presentation. So uh, sometime you will forget to save your presentation or sometime you will, uh, your Microsoft PowerPoint will automatically crashed or sometime your operating system will be also automatically crashed. So in that case you have to recover your Microsoft PowerPoint presentation. So if you are also trying to recover your Microsoft PowerPoint presentation, then you are in the right video. So after watching this video, you don't have to watch any video to recover your Microsoft PowerPoint presentation. So just you have to watch this uh, video until the last and after watching this video until the last, you will be also able to recover your Microsoft PowerPoint presentation easily. Hello everyone. It's me Dipes Rai. Welcome back to in my YouTube channel. If you are watching this video first time, don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel and don't forget to press in the bell icon. So if you want to get all the updates about my YouTube channel, please follow in my Instagram account also. I am giving you the my profile link in the video descriptions. So without any late, let's begin our tutorial. So guys, due to different kind of reasons or different kind of budget, you will forget to save your Microsoft PowerPoint. So in that case, how can you recover your uh, Microsoft PowerPoint presentation? So it's too much easy. So first of all, you have to uh, open your Microsoft PowerPoint just by pressing Windows key plus R. Then you have to type Power PNT in the run. So after this, just you have to click in the OK and you'll get this kind of dashboard so after this one just click in the blank presentation okay so it will take a little bit time it depends on your computer system so now you can see here I'm uh, uh, I'm inside uh, in a blank presentation okay so after this just go to in the file and just click in the options so now you can see here my new windows will pop up after that just you have to click in the save so now we can see here here is a few settings you have to set um, those settings so now you can see here it, uh, your Microsoft PowerPoint is giving you an option save or to recover information every 10 minutes it means your every uh, uh, Microsoft uh, PowerPoint uh, presentation will save in every 10 minutes so, uh, so you have to save your PowerPoint presentation uh, in uh, every one minute. So that's why I'm decreasing the uh, times. It means uh, my my PowerPoint presentation will automatically saved after each one minute. So that's why it will increase the uh, probability uh, of uh, recovery of your PowerPoint presentation. So after this, it's giving me the keep the last auto save version if I close without saving, and it's giving me the auto recover file location also. So it means using this uh, location, you can recover your Microsoft PowerPoint uh, unsaved uh, presentation. Okay, so it's too much easy. Uh, so now you can see here there are few features also available, but in this case, I am just uh, setting all these settings only so after this just click in the ok so after clicking in the ok um, so if i want to recover those files what to do just you have to press uh, windows key plus e then you will open your uh, windows explorer then after that you have to click here in the search bar then just paste your location link and just press in the press enter so now you can see here are few files which can be recovered so after uh, clicking uh, in those file you will be able to recover your microsoft powerpoint presentation so it's too much easy to recover your microsoft powerpoint presentation that's it if you have still any kind of confusion let me know in the comment sections 
I'll try to make a separate video on that topic also and share this video to among the people who are trying to recover their Microsoft presentation maybe this video will help uh, for them also okay so if you get some knowledge or if you recover your presentation then please give me a like it will give me some motivation to make more videos on this YouTube channel so I'll come back with another new video until that goodbye see you again